Hey, hey, it's me, Carrie Karen again, and today I am here in the back of a website where I'm going to talk a little bit about images. I'm sure that if you've had any experience in the back end of a WordPress website, when you are in the page editing area and you have two images that you want to set next to one another, sometimes what happens is you have a real difficult time getting those two images to stay aligned next to one another on the front end of your website. So here's an example of two images that appear as though they're side by side in the back end of the website. Yet when we look on the front end of the website after it's published, or even in a preview mode, we see that these two images, in fact, are not next to one another. So the first thing that we need to determine is why, what is causing these two images not to show up next to one another. In this case, when we look at this, we can see that the area that we have to fill goes from right here on the edge of the content all the way to the other edge of the content. And so we have to kind of judge and look and see if the size image that we have has left us enough room to put in two images side by side. All images are going to have some sort of margin and padding on either side of them. In this case, it appears to me that these two images are likely taking up too much space to be in the same area. And thus, if it doesn't fit, it's going to push it down to the next level. So the first thing that I'm going to check is to ensure that it is not the size of the image that is causing the issue. And the real simple way to test that is I go into my image and we are going to simply check 90% of the image and update it and do the same thing for the other one and update it. Oh, and before I go on, uh, we did in this one, you notice that the, the, the selection we have is none. And that is, in fact, the, the selection that you want. So let's make sure that this one also has none. This one has left, so we're going to change it to none. All righty. And let's uh, preview our changes. We're going to click on our website and we're going to wait for it to refresh and scroll down. And lo and behold, our pictures are right next to one another. Now you can see that they are relatively close together and it looks like, um, you know, the Prince William's charts lining up pretty nicely here. But Prince Catherine, we, I think we can move that one out just a little bit. Now you don't want to go too far because the minute you go too far, what's going to happen? That image is going to jump down to that second row again. So let's see where we're at with that. A lot of this I refer to as the dang it method. You try it and see if it works and dang it, it's not right, try again. Okay, so that's looking pretty good. Uh, might even, we can see right here that this edge of this picture um, still has quite a bit of, pay, of space to go before it actually ends up going to the next line. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a few more spaces. We'll go three more and see what that does. Preview, refresh, and scroll down. And that's looking much better. So now we have nicely balanced images. I do see that there might be a little bit of space up above these images that I can uh, delete and move this up a little tighter. So I'm going to see about that. The way that I get to that. You can go ahead and click right above the image, and if you see that it is on a line that's above it, you can delete it until it moves it up. And then we're going to update this time because we know it's going to work. We know where our pictures are balanced, and now we know we're close. And now when I go to this page, when I refresh on the front end after it's published, we have two images that are side by side, nicely spaced. Thanks for your time.